Hi everyone, this is Sunberry Medium, and welcome back to Hollow Knight. This is probably, well, definitely, <laughs> the, going to be the last episode of this series. Because uh, either I succeed or either I don't. Uh, but I don't. I don't think I have it in me to work to manage to uh, try more if ever I, I don't succeed. So basically the idea is still defeating Nightmare King Grimm. And this episode is going to be only that. I'll try until I... I succeed or I just don't want to try anymore. <laughs> it's a tough fight, I've tried uh, training a bit but I didn't take that much time uh, actually. We'll see how it goes but yeah I, I'm a bit tired of that so uh, I'll just try it, try it, try it, see if uh, I get it, if uh, my patience wears off or whatever, if time, like I spend way too much time on this. I'll stop and uh, I'll actually, th there's a way of uh, finishing that uh, DLC another way without fighting, so I'll do that, probably. Uh, and if I succeed, well, perfect, I'll be happy. <laughs> uh, but I don't believe in it too much, because although I'm a, like I'm definitely better than uh, when I started, um, this fight really requires skills, and uh, I don't think I'm there. Anyway, let's try it. Uh, it will probably be a heavily edited video because uh, there's definitely going to be a lot of failures. Also, I don't know if you saw, but I, I changed a bit my setup. I'm not using the blue health anymore because I can't recharge it. Uh, and I feel like there are, even if there, it's a bit rare, there are moments where I can take health back. So, I was thinking maybe I could get more than what I have with the blue uh, help. Basically, that's the, the idea behind it. So, uh, what do I have? I, actually, we should look at it. Uh, that's not the... Yeah, it was the right button. That doesn't work. Maybe I can check my inventory here. I've never tried that. Okay, well, we'll check my setup uh, next time, I guess. But let's try. Um, okay. Let's see what he comes with first. Okay, that's one. He's not the worst. If I'm fast enough, I can hit him. This one, I don't always react fast enough. This one sometimes catches me because he can shoot. Quite far, oh, I'm too far. Oh. Oof. Two, three, four, and I hit. Oops. Jump. This one, there must be a better way, but I, I don't think it's it. Take that. Oh. Ah, the dodge. Oh, come on. Problem is he hurts so bad that once you start getting hurt. This is one of the top thing. Okay. Oh, come on. Oh, 
Okay, I could heal a bit. <gasps> Dang. Oh, wrong one. It wasn't the worst run, but I'm still so far from beating him. Because from what I know, he does the... How, how do you call it? Like when he's got little spikes and there's fireballs everywhere. He does that three times. So, uh, I can only do it once. I I've never seen it twice that phase. So, so that's why I'm saying it's going to be tough. Uh, beating him, but that was actually probably one of my best runs like at the beginning. I wasn't getting hit for a long time That was nice Anyway, so I have a yeah better strength with unbreakable strength quick focus to try and heal a bit faster sprint master uh, I Didn't know what to put with one point the Grim Child, you have to have it. Unbreakable Heart, you have a little more health. Uh, and the Void Heart, uh, because uh, I don't think you can remove this one. So, that's my gear. Uh, as you can tell, I'm not gonna talk too much either, because uh, <laughs> I need to focus a bit. Uh, but yeah, it's really, really a tough fight. And I've already spent yeah, quite some time, just on the first attempt, so there's not going to be hundreds of attempts. But yeah, if I could anticipate a bit better uh, where... I just got hit there. When he does that, if I could know where his flames are going to go... That would be nice. Ah, uh, that won't work. Maybe this? Oh, well, no. Missed him. Well, actually, I should do it here. There, take it. Should have gone through him. No. Nah, I never do it. Well. Oh, come on. Should not have jumped. This one's going poorly. Ah, oh, yeah, whatever. Oh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, yeah, eleven. I was uh, wondering why I had only one life left, but it was. Uh, I've got an odd number of uh, health points. But yeah, it's it's gonna be rough. <laughs> but I need to basically keep in a good mood. If I uh, get impatient or mad or whatever, I'm not going to get better. I need to stay a bit calm, which is tough. Like My heart's already beating a bit because uh, you have to be, you know, on point. Um, try to react fast and stuff like that. But uh, yeah, I, I'm sure I could make it on a good, good run with a bunch of luck. Well, not like that. Can't base a second hit. I know I've done it. You really don't have a lot of time to do anything. <laughs> Oh, 
Ah, whatever. I went too far. I was stupid. Uh, yeah. And I don't know exactly when I can heal. I think I can do it here. Oh, come on. Mm, I don't know what I've been doing. Bad one. Really bad one. Also, I'm already sweating on my controller. Seriously. <laughs> Uh, are you gonna give me a possibility to hit you or? Got me when going up. Mm. That one's bad. Have jumped. Ah, come on. I almost got hit twice. I think I still had the invincibility frames. I don't know why I didn't identify this. Stupid.
Oh shit. Stupid. Oh no. Oh no. This is so bad. I, I that's the best run I've ever ever had. And I don't think I was too too far. I don't know how much, but I could have made it. I just gradually lost it uh, at the end there. Uh, but my heart rate was getting a bit fast, <laughs> I think. <laughs> and my controller was basically wet. This is horrible. <laughs> but that's the kind of run that tells me I can do it. It's just a matter of being a bit lucky and maintaining my um, focus and cool. Uh, which is really not easy. Basically, I should never acknowledge that I'm doing well uh, because uh, the moment I do, I'm like, oh, I need to, you know, not fail more. Well, it, it's like, I've already been so far, I can't do anything wrong. I need to continue doing good. So it puts pressure and whatever. <laughs> I need to go down. But yeah, very good run. But definitely one of the things that helps is uh, not talking too much. So I'm sorry for that uh, video, which I already don't talk much usually, and I'm not the best commentator, but here it's going to get way worse. But I think I, there's no way I'm making this with chatting all the time and being unfocused generally. And I got hit twice. Ah, oh, okay. That's a bad one. Not a bit lucky here. I could have been hit by his uh, trail or whatever. Oh, I didn't look well. Okay, let's try something. Oh, well, I tried wrong. I was trying, I wanted to try and heal. Uh, see if I could get back into it. Uh, but obviously that didn't work. Also, I'm definitely getting my soul back each time because that helps way... Uh, that's not going the way I want it to go. It, it helps a lot. <laughs> my
count correctly. Which is, oh, which is very stupid because it's only... I only have to count to four. Ah, when he jumps up, he moves a bit forward. Oh. This is not gonna be a good one because I'm a bit close. Oh, come on! I don't know how I dodged that. Oh. Yeah, I can't heal. That was the worst idea. Like I should have just, uh, yeah, should have just, uh, I should just be content by healing uh, one health point and not try to be greedy and get the second one. I, I I often do that mistake, but it's when in the fight, it, it's hard to make this decision. I don't know. It's this fight is definitely very manageable. Uh, if you take your time, if you, um, not take your time, when you have it. But like each time there is a, a, a moment of respite, you need to, well, either still attack or either heal, but don't be greedy, heal only one point. Wait for the next opportunity to heal. Uh, stack a bit on uh, soul, because uh, it, it, it basically that's what's a bit tricky. Well, it's the case for a lot of games, uh, but uh, soul is used both for attacking. Uh, it's very much stronger than uh, the, a nail attack, I think. Uh, but it also uh, helps healing, and in that regards, it's very expensive. Healing costs a bit too much for what it is. Well. In some sense, I'd say I think it's actually very well balanced. Uh, but attacking with a soul is gonna make the fight shorter because you're gonna deal quite a lot of damage. But you can't allow to do that at the expense of risking your life. So if you were, if I were perfect at the game and I would dodge everything, I wouldn't care about soul for healing. But here I know I need it, because there are some times where I get a hit quite a lot. <laughs> and, so, and often in a row, because the first hit kind of throws me off. So yeah, it's not a fight 
only against him. It's a fight against myself and my my automatisms, my uh, febrility, I, I guess. I don't know if that's the same word in English, but since I'm so on edge during the fight, my heart's beating fast, I'm, you know, really focusing, really trying to have all my abilities there. I actually get to the point where I lose uh, a bit of my abilities because I get overwhelmed by all of that. And I have to uh, manage to keep a notch down from that to still be able to respond. It, it's... I don't know how to describe it really, but it's... it, it is tough. Um, probably one of the things in a game that's the hardest I've tried. Like, I know there's way harder things in games, but uh, I, I also know I have limits, so I usually don't go too uh, far in challenging stuff in games. But it is... Um, like, I guess there's a bit of adding value in it. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, I need to get out of here. Oh! Shoot, I didn't count correctly. That's very dumb. But yeah, it was an opportunity to heal because uh, I was off. I wouldn't have been able to hit him anyway. Yeah, this, this time it didn't work. Okay, let's try to focus back and heal. Okay, this is a perfect opportunity. One hit, not more. Here I'm gonna hit him because that's... Uh, here I'm not gonna hit him. I'm gonna heal on one point. Let's try and... Oh, yeah. I know, I've been off uh, with that quite a lot lately. But yeah, I'd like to get a bit of soul. Oh, I'm already at that step. Oh. <laughs> the wall jump is actually very useful. I... That's not the strategy I developed while uh, training. I just noticed that uh, last time I did it. So... I think getting very close to the wall really helps because y you basically have... Uh, uh, way more possibilities to jump. have soul anymore. It surprised me. So, probably would be wise... Ah, uh, shoot. That's bad. Yeah, I was gonna say, I'm trying to, I'm gonna try and get normal hits on him. Just because I think, ah, but if I get hurt while doing that, that's not gonna be good. Oh, ah, usually when I jumped before, that doesn't hit me. Maybe I didn't jump as high as usual. But yeah, I'm uh, at a point where I need both uh, soul and health. That's not a good point. Shoot, I jumped too high, that's very dumb. Shoot, that was stupid. 
What did I say about being... Oh... That's the first time I got hit like that in this whole uh, session. But it happens. If I hadn't been greedy, I could have probably survived a bit. Maybe even healed. Actually, going back to the bench is cool. It helps me cool back down, I guess, a bit. Try to heal as soon as we can. Not actually. Ah, didn't even hit him or whatever. I'm just losing soul here. Oh, yeah, uh, got greedy. Oh. And when it starts... Too high. Okay, that's very bad. Oh, really? Yeah, that's the end. That was so bad. There, there's been a big stretch here where I just lost it. I didn't need that.
Alfred. What? Oh, and so... Yeah, yeah. Something went off. I don't know what, but I was really not timing it anything well. Uh, it's getting me desperate, kind of. <laughs> like... I feel I'm so close, but also so far. It's... Hmm, it's like right at the grass. It's weird. Don't do that ever again. I, oh, I went the wrong way. I mean, all of the ways to get hit are stupid in here. Like, technically, once you know how to deal with every attack, you shouldn't get hit by any of them. Well, except for the fireballs one, because there's so many stuff happening there. Okay, healing just once. Oh, I could have lasted a bit longer. That's bad. Okay, that's not too bad. I need to hit him a bit. Shoot! Twice, that's good. Yeah, I need to do that more often. Like dash when he does that. Oh, why can't I? Why do I fail that? That's one of the ones I really shouldn't fail. That's the worst thing to do. Dashing with this one is a guaranteed hit. Back with this attack.
think it's actually this that I need to count and not the times he does the fireball attack. doesn't work often. Did I do it? Please. It really looks like it. <laughs> yes! You, you have no idea how happy I am. I mean, I'm almost tearing up. What's that? Oh, hey! Oh, you're just staying around? Oh, that's so cool! Oh wait, they, they left, basically. I heard a piercing cry from the well. It echoed about my mind and left me all the days. I'd say it was a full beast's death, but this cry sounded different, divine. Has something happened, little traveler? No, don't tell me. If foul events are brewing, it's probably better I don't know. But that is so cool. I am very happy here. I, I really didn't think I had it in me. But uh, fair is fair. A bit of luck was involved. Uh, I, I, like, I, I definitely don't have the skills to do that uh, regularly. I have to have a bit of luck in one run, so I'm on the edge there, but uh, I, yeah, uh, that's so nice, and I mean, I, I was a bit sad to uh, have to end that DLC without beating um, him. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm a bit <laughs> all over the place, uh, but yeah, that, that's, that's very cool. How long did it take me? Less than one hour. I mean, I've made training sessions that were longer than this and didn't even get close to that. So that that's very cool. 
Um, but yeah, probably the biggest challenge I did in this game. Well, definitely. <laughs> uh, and there are definitely worse things to do in, in the... Uh, how's it called? The God Home? Yeah. Uh, but that is where I draw the line. <laughs> I will not be doing that. I mean, I've told so often on this channel. So that's gonna be it for Hollow Knight. A very, very well done game with a, a basically a Metroidvania with a lot of content, with well-balanced uh, stuff, uh, quite precise in its gameplay. It's got a, such an ambience too, and I think that's a big part of uh, why this game is so beloved. Uh, that and the fact that the creators are really in touch with their community. Like, they they exchange a lot with them. They, well, I mean, it's been uh, financed by the community at the beginning, right? Through Kickstarter, yes. Uh, so it's a very... it makes a very good game. Um, and to be honest, without having all the hype and all of that, because I, I came to the game later on, uh, I... Yeah, I got into it a lot. I really enjoyed it. I like discovering the story, uh, even if it's um, it's a bit hard to piece together. Like, uh, it doesn't say much in the end, so you have to uh, find little pieces of lore, try to guess a little bit of, of stuff. But it, it, the mystery is also uh, helping the ambience of the game. So, uh, I, I, I'm not going to say uh, I don't... Uh, like that they don't explain more because I think it, it wouldn't have the same charm to it. And I'm pretty sure, yeah, basically for uh, tryhards, this game's perfect because it's got challenge. <laughs> so, so yeah, very good. Very good. I, I, I really enjoyed it. I mean, what episode are we at? 56, I think. Something like that. So, um, that means, uh, I mean, I wouldn't have played it that much if I hated the game, right? <laughs> or if I didn't like it as much, I wouldn't have done that. Like, trying that hard for a boss, I would have g given up uh, way earlier. Especially since there's another way to finish the DLC, I would have been, hey, I'm just gonna do that. Well, I was close to, but not because I don't like the game, but because the challenge was starting to get whew, rough. Um, but yeah, yeah, it's it's an awesome game. I mean, people know it. The game sold very well. It, it it's yeah. And uh, yeah, I, I will I will definitely play the the next game, uh, Silk Song. Although I I'm a bit tempted not to play it when it gets out like straight away, in the sense of this game had a lot of DLC, and I played it with all the DLC because it was all out and. I liked having all the content available. So I'm a bit tempted to want the same thing for Silk Song. I, like, I might buy it when it gets out just to support the developers in a way, but I might not play it immediately. And, and I won't play it uh, outside of the channel, because I, I liked also discovering it with you. Um, some of you are a bit... Uh, how to say that? Tempted, I'd say, to uh, spoil. Uh, so I have to be a bit careful about that, and if the game has been uh, out for a while, there, there's a risk with that. Uh, but I, I think you've been quite careful enough, so that was cool too, and I, and I, I like that. Um, it's one of the things with YouTube, like uh, I started YouTube being like, hey, nobody is probably going to watch my videos, and it, that's very close to the truth. There's not many people watching. Uh, and I wanted just to train talking, uh, I liked playing, so it was a, a way of forcing, my, well, forcing, taking a, a time for me to play. I wanted to learn a bit of uh, uh, video editing, even if it's not too much. But uh, in the end, there are games where there's uh, people, a little community that comes even on my channel, and uh, we exchange, they give tips when I ask for them, or even when I don't, but they don't try to tell too much. I really like that exchange. So this game is also important for that, because it's one of those games where I got a little exchange. Um, I wish I had that for all of the games, but I do understand that there's not the same people watching this different type of games but uh, to be honest Hollow Knight like Metroidvanias 
I, I like platformers, like the, which is the basis uh, of any Metroidvania. So that's fine, and it's got exploration, which is cool. Uh, some this one got lore, that's awesome. It's got good music. I I can enjoy good music. <laughs> uh, so yeah. Uh, but yeah, there's a, the bonus of having the community behind it uh, and having uh, people who had, have been very caring in some way in the comments. And that's very cool. Uh, and we can tell, I can tell they really love the game and that's why they are here. <laughs> so that's, that's very nice too, having that sentiment behind all of that. Uh, but yeah, I, I should not ramble for too long. In the end, what I wanted to say is I don't want to play Silk Song too early, but I also don't want to play too late. I'll try to, uh, maybe I'll try to uh, check uh, on the game how it's trying to develop or whatever. And uh, if I see like the DLCs are not going to get out until years, maybe I'll, I'll play it without the DLCs. Uh, if I see they're going to come steadily, I might wait. Uh, I don't know, stuff like that. I I'll try to keep in touch uh, with the, the game. I, I expect a lot from the next game, but we'll see when it's out. Uh, in any case, this series is done. It was awesome, and uh, I hope you enjoyed it too. I hope you enjoyed this particular episode, because uh, I put my literal sweat in it. <laughs> Uh, but to be honest, it was enjoy. I, I, it was enjoyful. It was, it was very fun for me. I, I losing my vocabulary. Uh, but yeah, 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 very cool. Uh, I hope I'll see you in another video, even if it's for another game or whatever. Thank you for watching, from the bottom of my heart, and I'll see you in something else. But for now, goodbye. considered there's one thing that's uh, that i'm a bit sad about is i'm not gonna use this guy i have got the strongest version of him and uh, now i'm just not gonna play <laughs> with him